Que onda, wey? Welcome to this player go test for retaining like Kellen Acosta. The 20 year old center defense in Medus has a 68 overall. So, uh, pretty promising young American players played uh, for the U.S. Uh, national team recently. The senior national team has played quite a bit for the youth national teams in the past, but 5 foot 10 CDM fullback, uh, right footed, medium high work rates, 5 star weak foot, 2, two star skimmer. So, again, with that 5 star weak foot, uh, you can play him on either side as a fullback, which makes him very valuable in that sense. So, um, some good physical stats from the starts. So, uh, decent pace, uh, agility balance not too bad, good uh, jumping and stamina and strength definitely is going to improve over the years uh, which you'll see at the end of this first season up to the 70 mark, uh, some good improvement to the other areas physically, still needs quite a bit of improvement in those technical stats, uh, passing marking and tackling especially the dribbling is not going to improve all too that much um, basically for for CDMs in this game, but uh, more improvement to the strength, plus 3 up to the 73 mark, looking very good almost all green in those physical stats which is a very good sight to see uh, for any player. That's some more improvements here. Uh, decent passing it looks like. Uh, marking and tackling in that green also now. Just waiting for that long pass to hit that mark. Uh, and dribbling is not too bad. Um, he definitely feels a bit better on the ball than his dribbling may say when he does get forward because of that solid agility and balance and of course the decent pace and nice little strength he has on him. As the strength is all the way up to the 79 mark now. So again very steady growth for him in that, in that area of his game um, without training and all that. But uh, tracking back against a wonderful midfielder in uh, wonderful winger uh, and Eden Hazard uh, tracking back and winning that ball back you know pushing him off the ball after to use that pace to catch up to him now winning the ball here in that midfield and pushing forward uh, can use that pace and then eventually play a very nice ball through so uh, he can be a bit of a box to box midfielder but he did you may want to train his uh, dribbling a little bit um, if you do play him a little bit in that role but he can still have those little runs forward on occasion with nicely here with that build up play um, and eventually showcasing some of that agility uh, and playing a good little pass through here so uh, can foray forward occasionally but don't expect him to be amazing uh, dribble or anything it's him again tracking back pushing players off the ball a uh, wonderful um, player who I played as a CDM as well as a fullback and really uh, shine in both of those spot spots in my opinion and again can play both sides left back and right back as he quite a few highlights of him just tracking back winning the ball back and then of course recycling possession so uh, definitely depends on you know how you want to use him on uh, whether or not you may use training basically but uh, without training he looks wonderful uh, with that 84 strength, um, if you're going to play him as a CDM or fullback, he's going to really be able to track back with that pace and push and push players off the ball. Uh, unfortunately, he did not pick up any specialties or anything, but you'll look at him um, with his calculations regardless here. So uh, 74 as a CM, uh, 73 as a right mid, left mid, then of course 77 as a C CDM, 77 as a center back, 77 as a fullback, and 77 as a wing back. So uh, would be a wonderful fullback for you. Um, without training, he turns into a great one, especially because the way that strength throws, uh, high stamina also, decent passing, decent marking and tackling, uh, can occasionally get forward as his dribbling isn't too bad and has some good ball control on him also, um, pretty good vision and aggression, just wish the interception was would have gotten, gone up a little bit more, that's one area of course you may want to improve with training which will make him even more effective fullback and CDM for you, but a uh, very solid player, I definitely think he'd be good for like championship sides uh, and all that, I think it'd be kind of a good shot for him in those types of teams uh, where you can maybe give him some time to grow. Uh, without training and all that so you can at least get some of that a little bit of that strength growth um but uh, with that guys i definitely would take a look at him so with that thanks for tuning in i'll be signing out now and i'll catch you guys later